our product is developed for people that used to see, but they cannot see anymore because of disease. So our partners, Pixium and the Vision Institute, developed uh, some uh, devices, a camera integrated into glass that can collect the information from your environment and will send the information to your retinal implants. And in the retinal implants, there is some electrodes that will stimulate the retina. I think graphene is a big improvement compared to metal because the metal is not flexible, it's rigid, and graphene can really stick on the retina. This is a prosthetic hand, and in fact, it's working by uh, moving the hand through the electrical signals given by the muscles. Normally, commercial electrodes are quite big and heavy and invasive and have cables and are made by titanium. We started by covering the uh, electrodes with just graphene cellulose papers. Well, in the future, what we would like and could be interesting is to have the uh, electrodes and the wires included, for example, in a fabric that could be used and inserted in the socket. Graphene is conformable, it's light, it's flexible, so it would be really a plus for the patients using this hand. We are making a wellness monitor that can measure uh, heart rate, oxygen saturation, but also breathing rate, uh, skin temperature, and uh, we're currently working on measuring hydration. So we use graphene as a light sensor to do wellness sensing. And because we use graphene, we can integrate our sensors very closely onto the skin, and we can measure more wellness parameters than current wellness monitors can do. So the, the current status of our uh, wellness monitor is that we measure uh, heart rate and oxygen saturation with this patch. We will take it from here, we will make it transparent, we will integrate all the data processing and in the future it will look like this. Mm -hmm.